Hi, this is Shadi, and I know this topic might seem humorous or as if it's some kind of a joke, but there is something to be discussed through this because I do believe that judo holds a lot of solutions and taking away techniques is not a solution to whatever happens on the Olympic scene or whatever because judo for me, it's not the Olympics, it's far more than that. So let's take a look at Steven Seagal's solution to when someone goes for your legs and it's him, it's for one of those Aikido strikes on the face or on the back of the neck uh, with the open palm or the old jujitsu ways of striking with the hands. So here we all know at, by now that Moro Tegari or reaping with both hands is an old technique of judo. Now granted it is illegal nowadays in competition so it's rarely taught but you can see it here it, it can be done directly as people call it shooting or it can be done from the gripping uh, the sleeve and the lapel so here you see you pull and then as they provide some resistance by taking their center of gravity backwards they are prone to be hit with morote igari so i prefer it to be done more from the gripping because it shows great upper uh, interaction with the gripping and then from there you can actually go and show another skill which is going for the leg now let's see it in competition in the old days so here you see without any interaction it's not a very graceful throw i understand why a lot of people do not like it but nonetheless it's a very effective way of going into the ground hence why it is adopted in brazilian jiu-jitsu here is the legendary tani going for it from the grip fighting from there goes from for a single and then a double leg takedown reaping both legs now the solution to this is found in the gokyo and it is none other than tawara gaishi so here you see the key to it to not collapse under the pressure of the hands is to get one leg back which gives you a very stable base and from there you readjust your stance and then you sacrifice yourself backward arching your back, uh, hurling them over. It's a great way um, to counter this technique and it is found within judo. So when it comes to shooting and people thinking that judokas are absolutely helpless against shooting, the answer is within the same book. Another one here is Harai Goshi. Harai Goshi has been done all throughout and now I see a lot of foot sweeps and reaps and judo techniques uh, finding their way into wrestling while judo is taking techniques away for wrestling and the more i study um, the judo history and techniques the more the leg grab rule makes no sense uh to me the more i study the more it makes uh the more absurd it seems to me so this is a very small video i wanted to show that the whole thing with shooting and leg grabs it's all within the judo book and repertoire so uh, judo has solutions and counters for everything uh, and attacks and defenses for everything so when it comes to steven seagal yes i know it's very comical and uh, this clip has been shared all around it's from jesse Encamp's uh, video but uh, there is something to be discussed there and taking away techniques is never the solution in my opinion. So if you have ever anything else to add, please let me know down below. This was Shadi and thank you for listening.